Hello guys and welcome back to the channel it's Nina if you were new here welcome happy that you're here and if you're not new welcome back how's it going today I felt inclined to teach a song from speak now because on the poll that I put out last week a lot of you wanted 1989 but the second highest was speak now so that's what we're doing today we are going to be learning Back to December which is one of my favorite songs from that album and it truly just gets better with time. I have already taught a brief tutorial of this song on one of my combo videos so if you want to go check that out the link to that video is up here or in the description box below but the version I'm teaching today is different from that one so if you don't like these chords you can go look at that one. If you'd like to see the tab that I wrote for this song that links in the description box and if you would like to practice this song after you watch the tutorial I post a full-length demo on my other channel where you could play along with me and it's just lovely But yeah, let's get into it Okay for this version the capo is going to be on the second fret and the chords you're gonna need for this song are C A minor E minor And you're gonna need F or F sus 2 I like F sus 2 and same thing with G you're, you can either play regular G or G sus 4, which I think sounds better with this song. So it's up to you. I play the suspended chords. The intro is going to be C, A minor, F. The C is going to get a full measure, and then you're going to split the second measure between A minor and F, and I will show you. So the strumming for this is going to be down, down, up, up, down, up, down, up. And that's for the C. And then when you go to the A minor, you're gonna go down, up, down, up, and then go to the F. Down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. So I'll start from the C and we'll go slow. So down, down, up, up, down, 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 up, down. That's just the basic strumming pattern for the intro. You're gonna repeat that whole thing twice, and then it's gonna go into the verse. So a little bit faster, it's gonna sound like this. Try to play along. So for the verse, it's going to be C, A minor, F. They're going to get that first strumming pattern we had for the C. Then we're going to split the last measure and it's going to be C, G. And for that part, it's going to be down, 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 up, down, 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 up. So we're going to go slow. Start with C. Down, down, up, up, down, up, down, up. And then A minor. go to the C and then the G. Down, 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 up, down, 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 up. And then you repeat that whole thing again. And that's going to be your whole verse. So let me just sing it slowly and we'll go through it. So I'm so glad it's time to see that again for the second part and then it goes into this pre-chorus for the pre-chorus it's going to be a minor G C F and then it's gonna be a minor G F and for the pre-chorus you're gonna stick with that shorter strumming pattern that we did for C and G we're gonna go a minor down 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 up and then to G down 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 up C Back to A minor, G, and 
on this last F, you're gonna go back to the long strumming pattern. So I'll just go through that slowly for you guys, and I'll sing. Because the last time you saw me is still burned in the back of your mind. I gave you roses, and I left them there to die. So you're gonna start singing the chorus before the end of the pre-chorus, like you're done with that F, if that makes sense. Let's go over that transition slowly. So we've got, you gave me roses and I left them there to die. So this is me swallowing my bread. Okay, so you kind of see how it leads right into the chorus. So for the chorus, it's gonna be a little different. We have C, E minor, F, C, G. So basically you're just substituting the E minor for the A minor in the verse chord progression. So you're gonna do that pattern twice and then there's like a little post chorus end of chorus like hook that's going to be F a minor G at the very end, but we'll go through this whole thing slowly. So it's going to be the same strumming as the verse. So we have C to the C, G thing, so down, 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 up, down, 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 up, and then back into it one more time. And on the second time, when you go to the C, G, it's gonna go C, down, 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 up, G, and then you're gonna go into the F, down, up, up, down, up, down, up, and then it's gonna go, and I go back to the C. So you're gonna go A minor, down, 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 up, G. And then back into the instrumental. So the intro chords are going to be like the instrumentals between the chorus and the verse and all that. So I'm just gonna sing the second half of the chorus so you can see how it all transitions together. Turns out freedom ain't nothing but missing you wishing I'd transitions right back into that instrumental. It's gonna be C, A minor, F twice, and then into the next verse. So after the second chorus, you do that same instrumental, C, A minor, F twice, and then it's gonna go into the bridge. So for the bridge, the chords are gonna be A minor, F, C, G. You're gonna do that three times, and then the last two lines is just gonna be A minor, G, F, A minor, G, F. And the strumming is gonna be those short strumming patterns. So we've got A minor, down, 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 up, F, C, G. So you're gonna repeat those four chords like that three times. I miss your tan skin and your sweet smile. So good to me, so right. How you help me. Oh, so good. And then this part's kind of fun. This is just an added thing you can do where it goes. First time you ever saw me cry. Maybe this is wishful thinking. Probably mindless. So on that part for the A minor, you can do down, up, down, and cut. And then F, down, up, down, cut. So after that part, if you want to do the cut, the last C and G in that those stanzas is going to be a full strumming pattern. So it's going to go like this. Maybe this is wishful thinking. Probably mindless dreaming. But if we love to be right. It's gonna have that down, down, up, up, down, up, down, up for those two chords. And then the last two lines, you're just gonna single strum it or pick it or quietly strum, but it's going to be. I go back in time and change it, but I can't. So if the chain is on your door, Understand. And then we have this end chorus, which is going to be the same thing as the other choruses, except for it just has like a little different words and stuff. So, because it goes, and I go back to December. 
So you're gonna stay on that G for a bit before you go to the next C, so when it goes. That night, and I go back to December, turns out made nothing. So you can like downstrum that G, build it back up, because it starts quietly and it's like, this is me swallowing my pride, standing in front of you, saying I'm sorry for that night. And I On the end, she just repeats the end lines of both the choruses together. So she goes, turn around and make it all right. Turn around and change my own mind. So that part, you know, let's just play the end of this chorus together because I feel like I'm not explaining it well enough. So we got, I go back to December, turn around and make it all right. I go back to December, turn around change my own mind I go back to December all the time and you go back to the intro chorus all the time and that's the end but anyways, thanks for watching this tutorial. I hope I helped you and you weren't too confused. Keep commenting your song suggestions because I love going through them and looking at them. Just know that I try my hardest to choose the songs that m the most people want to learn. I'm not purposely ignoring anyone's suggestions. Try my best. Go ahead and subscribe if you want to see more tutorials and hop over to the Play Along channel so we could jam together and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye! Ow. Oh my god, I can't breathe. Taylor Swift's breath control is on another level. I can't do it. Mm -hmm.